Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Ink here again here on my channel here, King Ink on YouTube. If you haven't subscribed already, please consider subscribing. I um, have been trying to redo a lot of my stream stuff. I have a pretty interesting background. This is just my general desk area, so I am here all the time, and I thought it would be a cool background to share with everybody, so... I just neatened it up a little bit, but it's all my random little things here. Actually, I took a little trip to Five Below, so shout out to Five Below. Sadly, not a sponsored video. And I got a few items for my stream setup. So I will be doing a review first on the first item that I got. I'm going to be doing a few videos on this um, to have a little bit of content on my channel. Because this is a variety channel, for sure. It's not just gaming. So far, I know I have my Let's Plays. And I know we have a few review items before, but I'm trying to push out some more content. Again, if you haven't subscribed already, please consider subscribing down below. I appreciate you all so much. Um, hit that like, comment down below what you would like to see next. And I hope you enjoy the video, and I hope you guys check out Five Below, because it's one of my favorite stores. Um, but this is something that I got there, and this is some of the one of the new things that I saw. Um, I'm, I'm not exactly sure when this came out. It is, it is a multicolor led light bar actually by vibe essential basically it has a little remote which is cool and i'm glad this isn't one of the battery operated ones as far as i'm reading it it says rgb multicolor it's usb powered 15 colors and four modes so i am hoping that at least minimum with these more affordable like lower on the price range that at least it has the fade through the colors because that's the, that's the most I want just to be able to see all the colors it says RGB and white adjustable LED lighting and simple home technology but yeah it says it's USB powered so if that works out I can quickly just connect it onto my computer here it's down here in the corner I wish I had the space to have it on my desk like the cool gamers do but I do not Hopefully I do one day, one day, but for right now, I will make do with what I've got, which is having it on the floor and usually using, using it like a little shelf. I know some people might not like that completely, but it's what I've got. So if you would like to help me with my setup and stuff, consider subscribing is the way to go right now because, you know, unless you want to Venmo me some money, then I don't really know what to say. Uh, but here we go. We've got our remote here. Pretty straightforward. It's got all the colors, flash, strobe, fade, smooth. Okay, okay, okay. It's got, it's got the good modes that I like to see. And then here we have got, here, the light bar. Okay, nothing else in the package, so I'm going to drop that there. And then here it is in a bunch of bubble wrap. And there we go. Huh. Ooh, I dropped the manual or something. Oh. Oh, that's interesting. I At first I was confused. It looked like a little connecting, but I can do it this way. There's a little slot in here if you see. Okay. Here on the back. There we go. There we go. Better angle. Slot in the back. You just pull this out. There's a slot here. And there's a slot here at the end. So you can make it a light, a vertical light bar. So you have both the option to make it a vertical or a horizontal light bar. Or if not, take the stand off yourself and figure out a way maybe to stick it to the wall. Or, you know, do whatever you want with this. Because the cable's connected to this, not the stand. But let's see right here. I'm going to put it... Let's do vertical for right now, like the picture says. So here we go. Very excited that Five Below has come out with a few things for streamers and just, you know, kids and anybody who's trying to get into gaming. And gaming can both be on, usually on the expensive side, but it's nice to see that there's a few options coming out in the lower price ranges. Real quick. And there we go. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Is this sound activated or is it just glitching? Is this sound activated? Whoa, hold on. It looks like it's sound activated. Yo, this was only $5, you guys. $5 at 5 Below, not even part of the 5 Beyond. It looks like it's just a... This is like sound activated. 
Are you serious? Let's off on. Let's go with red. How low does that get? I guess that's the end of that. Okay, that doesn't do anything. Once you hit it to the lowest, it does this weird flashing. So I don't know what that's about. But then here, let's take it all the way back up. Oh, and then when you hit back up, I think it's just like an alert to let you know. I don't know if my video is going to catch that properly. Okay, that's a little bit different. See? A little bit different. That looks like hot. <laughs> so, warning for flashing lights right now. I'm going to hit the different settings. But here we have flash. Oh, it triggered my other lights. Hold on. Hello? Hello? What, what happened to my other lights? There's some strobe. Fade? Okay. This is a little weird. It's not it's not listening to It's not listening to what the remote says. What about smooth? Hello? Okay, weirdly enough, I think smooth is the motion censored one. See? See? Wait, no. Not too bad with the fact that it's motion censored, I will say. I'm going to be honest. For $5, it's really cool, but if you're okay with not listening to what the remote says, because if you guys take a look, that's what that says, but it won't listen to it. Because when I hit flash, it does like a, a cycle through colors. Strobe seems to be the fade. So strobe is the fade, at least on my remote. I may have gotten a bad one. At least an incorrect printing on this one. What about fade? Fade is like a sunrise. It's literally... It's just this color. And then smooth is the most... Is the sound activated. Which I'm very impressed with. With this being just a product of $5... I'm gonna hand it to them. It's not bad. I will say maybe just the remote is misprinted. I will say, um, I know some people, if you're gonna get a more advanced light bar, I know some people hook it up with their notification settings on Twitch or wherever it is they stream. But this one is just connected to your computer. There's nothing other than that. But I was not expecting the, the, the sound activation. That's pretty cool. I have... I have no complaints with this, for sure. I guess that's basically it. I can't really say much else from this, but I guess I'll give this from a scale of, like, five, let's say the five-star scale. I'll give this item, I'll give it, like, a four out of five. I'll give it, like, a four out of five, like, how much money it's worth. This is worth it. If you're open to ignoring the buttons, that that's basically it for the review today. Now, but yeah, this is it. Just a standard black white bar. This has been the Vibe Essential Light Bar from Five Below. I do recommend it. I'm gonna be honest. If you want a cheap light bar, a low priced light bar to put in your setup, and you're okay with these modes. And I'm hoping this video helped you guys out before you buy it. Yeah, if you guys are willing to work with what this has, because I'm going to be honest, the video doesn't capture what it looks like. It's, it's very shiny and not as accurate on the video. Do I recommend this light bar? Yes, I do. I give it like a four out of five stars. Um, it's not perfect. Um, but again, something from Five Below that's not even in the Five Beyond section is absolutely amazing. You can get yourself a few of these, maybe two, three of these, as many as you want, and set them up. Even, you know, be cool. If somebody got these, because this is just a line, if somebody got these and like drew something out or like a word on their background, this would really work.
as long as you're down to pay five bucks for this it's perfect if you're down to excuse that the remote doesn't have accurate wording on it to what the commands are go ahead but honestly what really sells this to me is sound activation like come on like where that that's that's awesome this has been vibe essential light bar from five below highly recommend and i hope you guys enjoyed this review today um, and i hope you guys go out to your local five below and get yourself one as well um, let me know how it is let me know where you put it and honestly if you're on my twitter consider like i'm down to see you guys' setups and especially how you use these light bars or anything else that you use from five below like i would love to check that out but thank you again everybody for tuning into my channel today this was a small little review consider if you haven't already please consider subscribing down below i would super appreciate it it would be a great support right now especially during these hard times um and give a like comment maybe comment what your favorite thing from five below is to get is to get if you're a regular uh if you're a regular there because i am my favorite thing to get are the shirts the shirts for sure my entire wardrobe except for this right here this was like clearance stuff and from another store my entire wardrobe for t-shirts is mainly just five below t-shirts because how are you gonna be a five dollar t-shirt like come on um, but yeah, thank you so much again, and I'll see you guys next time here on my King Ink channel, and thank you so much, you guys.